Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Amethyst, Glenn Robinson. Glenn Robinson's looking like a really, really good card at the small forward to power forward position. Bit undersized for power forward at only 6'7", but I do think he's going to be a legitimately elite option at the uh, small at those positions. And he looks like one of the best cards that came out in yesterday's lift off, car, lift off drop. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 14,000 subscriber mark on the channel. Less than 200 subscribers away. Try to hit that in the next couple of days so it really or really just before the end of october but i think that's super possible so would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe and without further ado let's hop right into it take a look at glenn robinson six seven small forward or power forward 92 offense 90 defense and 80 driving layup 88 close shot 84 midi 83 three ball 90 driving dunk 86 ball handles so he's got a high enough ball handle to speed boost has pretty decent all-around defense as well capable ish rebounder 85 speed and excel 85 lateral quickness i'm gonna try but power forward in today's video and see how he does Hot fast switch corner specialist and bulldoze which bulldoze is actually pretty nice uh 10 golds include pro touch catch you clay more bailout pogo stick big driver physical handles silver acrobat posterizer handles for this hyperdrive killer combos rebound chaser precision dunker bronze back down punisher drop stepper master agent three and space creator as well looks like a very very good all-around card he's super versatile statistically has good speed if his release is nice he is going to be a really really good all-around amethyst card uh let's see what the movement's looking like first and foremost so movement looks pretty good with the time burst that he's got He's going to be fine in terms of moving. He's going to be able to move a lot better than a lot of cards. Release is cash, too. Ooh, nice release. That feels smooth and easy and not too slow. That's a straight up and down release, too. That's a very good release for sure. I think you're looking at... Oh, my goodness. He has Curious... No way. Okay, hold on. So he's a dog because he has the Curry slide, too. This uh, Glenn Robinson card is maybe one of the best cards that came out yesterday. Like, seriously, of all of them. I, is he better than Carmelo? Because with this release, plus actually being a very capable defender and having the Curry slide, as well as this movement being solid, like this might be the best small forward that came out yesterday over Carmelo, and I'm not trolling. He looks really, really good. Having that Curry slide is dangerous combined with pretty good sigs and a very smooth release, as well as defensive capability. Overall, Glenn Robinson is looking like he's going to be an absolute dog. Not to mention he's an elite slasher as well, because why not? He's going to be a really, really Really good card in my team. Let's hop into a game. See what Glenn Robinson can do. Good. Wallop by KD on the first possession. Bosch with the board. Let's hop into our freelance. And I don't have the freelance on. Let me turn my freelance on real quickly. And then we'll get into our offense. And see what Glenn Robinson can do. Comes up me a nice little screen here. Bosch with the push cross. Attacking downhill. Hitting our pop. And I can't hit the pop. And immediately we do not get a bucket on the first possession. Not Glenn Robinson's fault at all. We just got the ball bumped away. But that's okay. Wall up here. Get back out. Good, MJ. Yep, we're good. We're chilling right now. All right, good defensive start. Uh, Marcus Saul isn't super fast. Ooh, Kyrie with a nasty move. Beats MJ off the dribble, gets downhill, and gets himself a bucket. Good stuff for Kyrie Irving. Let's go pick and pop here with Glenn Robinson, and then we'll put the ball in Glenn's hands and let him shot create if need be. Kyrie coming way up, and the CPU actually hedges or fouls there. So it is what it is. Uh, come get the ball again, Glenn. Glenn being guarded by Kawhi, by the way. Not exactly the favorable matchup that I'm looking for, because I'm looking for a little bit of an easier matchup. Kawhi Leonard is about as hard as it gets when it comes to matchups but uh attack here again and let's see what we can get going up uh, oh i had they gave me a shooting foul actually because i tapped x but i was going to dump that down uh they gave me a shooting foul because i was tapping x which is funny and that allows me to go to the free throw line and get a couple of free points hopefully assuming we can hit the second free throw as well free throw release seems pretty smooth and easy he hits both of them 76 percent isn't too bad on either one and they both go down so that's not too shabby to start us off offensively that curry slide is so nice but him being guarded by Kawhi is not my favorite thing ever because obviously Kawhi, one of the best couple defensive cards in the entire game right now especially on that perimeter good defense here wall up contest on Kyrie. let's watch this back door to desmond bain potentially now wall up again great defensive possession should be a should have been a board but it is what it is and marcus all with the offensive rebound wormed around us and got the put back to go so pump fake uh let's get a pick and pop going here um glenn robinson attacking the rim getting inside uh and we're just gonna hit it out to kd actually wide open shot that's great offense really nice pass by glenn robinson making the right read and knocking down the shot with kd that is that's good stuff that's good offense right there for sure uh let's play good defense again with mj this is just starting to really cook on the defensive end as well no way he just somehow backdoors and then 
throws the pass to where it basically creates the separation from the back door and gets an open shot. That feels a little fluky, but it is what it is. Pump fake here. Um, let's go this way. Curry slide back to the left. I messed up my move. My bad. We still get a lob. Great pass. He's got some playmaking chops to him with silver handles for days and pretty good sigs, as well as a high enough ball handle to speed boost uh, to get that time burst, like I've said. He does seriously have legitimate playmaking chops, which is really, really nice. Watching the back door again. He throws it again. This time, Kyrie able to get the stop, and we're pushing out in transition, pushing the ball up the court, across court to Glenn Robinson, who is just not open, and I just tried to force it, and it just wasn't there. My bad. Trying to rip there, trying to rip him there, not able to get the steal. Uh, play on the pop. Let's see if we can next switch this, get Glenn Robinson back out to the corner, and that is very good defense. He is boxed. You are caged right now. Good D. Up, step, watch the layup. Beautiful. No lane. Good. Dude, MJ is just so good defensively. I'm not even going to lie. Pump fake. I should have shot it. My bad. Reset the ball, though, and let's space the floor. Um, see what we can get going. Glenn Robinson attacking the rim. I mess up my timing burst again. Thankfully, he still gets downhill and detonates on the rim. Love to see that dunk. Showing me something right now. Four points and two assists. Like what I'm seeing, but I've messed up my timing burst twice now, which is kind of annoying because I would have been able to really explode downhill if I could have timed that better. But uh, watching the back door again. And rotating. Oh, I just gave it the back door. This dude literally is just backdoor made. He's backdoored three or four possessions in a row. That possession he backdoored twice, in fact. Uh, pick and roll here, though. Size it up. Attack it downhill with Kyrie Irving. We hit it out to Glenn Robinson. He's same side burst. Now back to the left. And I mess up my timing again, dude. Goodness gracious. And I have... I just can't can't get my offense going, man. Not, not, not how I want it to, anyway. It's annoying, but it is what it is. Um... Get a shot up, Kyrie. Oh, wait, hold on. Did I screen that? No, a little deep, and I shot an early as well, because I apparently suck. Um, contest here. Watch the backdoor cut. Uh, I'm assuming we're going to see a backdoor of some sort after his pick and roll doesn't work. He's going to try to throw it at my face, probably. Uh, somebody's going to backdoor. Be ready for the... Oh, that's actually a mismatch. Uh, swing out the corner. Glenn Robinson swinging. Good D. We're back. Good contest. Yes. What a great defensive possession. And Glenn Robinson running the floor in transition all the way downhill. Get into that paint and let's reset the ball. He's kind of tired. We're going to go pick and roll here. Give me a quick slip and show me that size advantage on Kyrie Irving. It does exactly that. Shoves him out of the way. That's that bulldozer badge right there. Physically overpowering Kyrie and getting himself an easy layup. Love to see it. Glenn Robinson was 6-2 and two this game. Has contributed to every single bucket that we've scored with either points or assists, which is totally great for me. Attack the rim again. Glenn Robinson, I wanted a stick dunk there and they gave me a layup animation and we missed the layup. That's annoying. I didn't even get to time try to time the layup or anything. That is unfortunate because I was trying to get a stick dunk. But Glenn Robinson still has played quite well in this game, I have to say. So not too opposed at all to his performance. He's a little gassed, which I don't love, but it is what it is. Um, and overall, good performance. So let's hop back to the main menu. Let's view the card. In conclusion, Glenn Robinson is definitely one of the best cards that came out yesterday. He's a really good card at the small forward or power forward position, I think. I think he's a little undersized at power forward, would probably stick to small forward, and probably would stick to putting him next to a lock, like somebody like an MJ at the two, or another really good defensive two, like a Dr. J, or somebody else you're confident in it on the defensive end. At the two or at the one, even if it's a D-weight at point guard or something like that. Uh, but Glenn Robinson, really good card. Shoots the ball well. Love the fact he's got the curry slide. He's super athletic. I think he's a legitimately good card in my team. So if you're looking for somebody to fill your small forward position, at a high level or even power forward, Glenn Robinson might be a great guy to consider. He's actually really good. So hopefully y'all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back on more 2K content very, very soon, and I appreciate y'all. Peace.